Living as close as I do to the ocean, like literally walk out my bedroom door, across the yard, and right here is Kalbara Beach, naturally gave birth to my A Wave A Day project. That's where I try to surf a wave every day in a given month, no matter what the conditions are, right here at Kalbara Beach. Now in 2019, A Wave A Day is brought to you by Global Surf Industries. They have generously sponsored me aboard throughout their entire range to help see me progress through the different skill levels of surfing. Their mantra, life is better when you surf, is certainly something I can attest to. You've seen how keen I am to get back in the ocean here and share this with you, the givers. Well, with their sponsorship, and this ocean, I'm going to show you how my life is better when I surf. Hello the internet! It is Wednesday the 30th of January 2019. Wave 30 of my Wave A Day project brought to you by Global Surf Industries. The ocean is large, yet there is no wind or very, very little wind. Kind of looks like yesterday without the wind. Strange. Today should be a little less drag, if you like. You know, we've been talking about the GoPro and all the drag issues. Well, GoPro did send me a session five. And I've put it back on. So we have less drag happening now. That is marginally better than having a Hero 5 down there. The Session 5 is a little bit smaller, squarer, less drag. Does that mean I'm gonna get less comments about drag? Only one way to find out. Let's go surfboard riding. This is the longest I've waited here to try to go out. Four minutes and 40 seconds and I haven't even started my paddle yet. On another day, another week, in another year I'm sailing. That has to be the longest I've waited at the edge of the water to pick my entrance point. There was no break in the swell. It actually went to six minutes and 30 seconds. Now that I'm out here, it looks good. I'm really spooked up here in these conditions. Every shadow. And another boat with a rock and a saloon. I'm sailing, I'm not waiting, I'm not sailing, I'm not waiting, I'm not sailing. I'm just explaining how I felt a little bit spooked by the shadows and the mind games. And then it was like, here comes a left. Get it! I mean, just before I came out here, I was watching Xander Round. He's a vlogger from the UK, happens to look exactly like me. I'm sorry for that dude. There's two of us out there that kind of sucks for the rest of the planet, I'm gonna be honest. Because he's in the UK and the weather's always shit, he doesn't want to let his weather and climate dictate what he does. And he referenced me as well. He said he got Ben on and Danny in Australia and the weather's always good. And yeah, like, look, I don't never take this for granted. This is Australia, we're very, very lucky to have this. Xander's been inspired to maybe go surfing. Now, that takes balls in the UK. I suggest you go for it, but vlog it. Make sure we see it because the extra points you'll get for going hardcore in those conditions. Look at this way. Woo! I'm not letting all these waves go to talk to you, the givers. Yeah! yeah. Trying a bit of grab rail on that one. Go down the front side, left. I was carving front side, grab my rail. Then the wave kind of disappeared. Good waves in there. I feel like they were powerful waves too. Were they, did they look larger than what I was doing, you know, like 10 days ago? I feel like I'm getting a lot more confident. If you enjoyed watching me get more confident, come back tomorrow for Wave A Day Part 31. Hey, thanks so much for checking out my Wave A Day Project 2019. If you like what you've seen here, please do subscribe to the channel there. Check out Global Surf Industries here. Check out yesterday's wave there. And for something entirely random on my channel, check this video. It may or may not be surf related. And just remember, life is better when you surf. Is your life better when you surf? Yeah, my life's better when I surf.